Hello everyone. Welcome back to the Angular Lab project. In this video, we will see how we can authenticate home page in Angular 8. So for that, let's go to the Visual Studio Code. And for uh, like after going in Visual Studio Code, first what we have to do, we have to install one AuthGuard service here. And for installing that AuthGuard service, what we have to do, we have to give a command and that command is ng g for generate g for guard and what i'm going to do i'm going to take a one folder auth and inside that i'm going to create a one auth guard and when i will hit enter it will ask like what kind of the uh, authentication type you want to create so um, like in my case i'm going to create a can active so after selecting hit enter so once you will hit enter it will create a one folder called auth and inside that we can see auth guard uh, dot ts file and in this ts file we have to uh, do the configuration and like in our configuration what we are going to check like our page authenticate or not so for that like what we are going to do we are want to return the true so for that like we can get rid of these other return type which is given by this so i am going to remove all these return type and here what i am going to check inside this method like currently it is returning so i want to return this value based on one condition and what is that condition i i will check the token so like if so if and inside this one i'm going to check local storage dot get item and inside this one i'm going to check the token and after uh, getting the token what i will check if it is not equal to null it means like this user is authenticated so what i can do i can return the true so for that one i'm going to take the curly brace and is in this one i'm going to return the true otherwise what i'm going to do if it is not authenticated then from here i'm going to like uh, return to the or navigate to the login page so for that one what i'm going to take i am i'm going to take a one constructor here so for that one let's take constructor and inside this constructor i'm going to take a one variable of router so uh, router and the type of this will be router and now let's make it as a private and inside this constructor let's close this one and through that router what i'm going to do i'm going to navigate and uh, let's navigate and where i'm going to navigate i'm going to navigate to the user and after that login so this i'm going to navigate from here and after that i'm going to return as a false so th this task we have to do like we have to authenticate the user now next what we have to do after checking here this auth guard we have to do in, into the app.routing.module so for home page we are going to authenticate so here let's put comma and can active and inside the can active we have to give this auth guard and here let's take the respective like a library so this is the next task now what we have to do like uh, here when we uh, get the student information so what we have to do we have to pass this authentication so for passing the authentication with the api what we have to do in in the user.service.ts the method which we have get a student info here we have to pass the token barrier and for passing the token variable barrier here what we have to do we have to take a one variable of header like we have to pass the header and new and then http headers so http headers and inside this one what we have to do we have to pass first is authorize so au authorize we have to write here authorization and with this what we have to pass we have to pass the barrier so let's take the barrier and space and then we have to pass the local storage like the token which we have 
so local storage dot get item and here we have to pass the token and after that what next we have to do we have to pass this token inside the uh, like here so here put the equal and this header we have to pass with this request and for that one what we have to do we have to take the header and instead this we will pass this header so this is the next task we have to do now let's compile the application so I will close this one and what I'm going to write I'm going to write the ng serve so let's come so application is compiled successfully let's go to the browser and here let's refresh it again and uh, let's give dot and one two three four five as a password click login and once we log in we see all the information as a welcome dot and whatever the information we have put there we we can see all this information now let's copy this url and open in the new tab and when i will hit enter we are getting the all information now let's log out from this application and try to access that home page once i will hit we are redirecting to the login page we are not uh, seeing that information even if i will refresh this information we will navigate to the login page so that uh, is the like implementation of the authentication now next what we will do in this like let's login login to the application here what we will do we will take a one link and when we will click on that link we will redirect to another page and there we will do all the current operation